Meghan Markle's half-brother vows to seek help after a drunken New Year's Eve brawl with his fiancé led to her being thrown in jail for assault. Meghan Markle's half-brother Tom last night vowed to seek help after a drunken brawl with his fiancé on New Year's Eve. The flare-up in their organ home led to Darlene Brown being thrown into jail for two nights for assault. Tom initially told the Mail on Sunday Ms. Brown had began pummeling me in the face with her fists, but last night he changed his tune and said the injuries he sustained were self-inflicted. And Tom, who was last year arrested for brandishing the gun at his fiancé during another drunken fracas, says they will both attend alcohol and relationship counseling. He blamed the pressure of being in the public eye for his woes saying, it hasn't been easy. Meghan's relationship with Prince Harry has shown the spotlight on our family. It doesn't help when you have issues and your sister is engaged to royalty. It adds a whole new level of scrutiny. We've been under a lot of stress because of all the attention. At some point you find yourself drinking too much to escape the pressure. As Prince Harry and M.S. Markle reportedly ushered in the New Year partying like tycoons in the millionaire's playground of Monaco. Tom and Darlene were downing beers and whiskey at the decidedly less salubrious Cedarwood Saloon in their hometown of Grants Pass. Tom, 51, who has the same father as Meghan, said he and Darlene, 37, rode at the bar before she stormed off. He returned to their bungalow and continued drinking, becoming increasingly enraged. When Darlene finally came home she immediately began downing a bottle of bourbon. I said some swear words, it turned into an argument. Tom confessed. Darlene called police, but ended up being arrested herself. I might have said that Darlene beat me up, Tom said. She was arrested for domestic violence. It was a big confusion. Mr. Markle, who paid $1,000 to bail his fiancé out of jail, said, we both been drinking. I was sitting on the couch and got up really fast, hit myself and gave myself a fat lip. Josephine County District Attorney's Office last night confirmed that Darlene would not face prosecution.